Hi Badgers, my name is Dr. Sarah Nolan and I'm the Director of Mental Health Services at UW-Madison. I'm Christina Olstead. My pronouns are she, her, hers, and I serve as your Dean of Students. We know that as the days get shorter and the weather turns colder, you may start to feel isolated, anxious, or depressed. You are not alone, and there are campus resources available to support you as you navigate academic work and maintain relationships during COVID-19. We want you to know that UHS Mental Health Services and the Dean of Students Office have many services available that can be accessed remotely for you during this time. Additionally, we want to share several tips that may help you feel healthier and happier this winter. Number one, be active. Whether you work out at home, in the gym, or outside, regular exercise can reduce symptoms of depression and improve mood. Number two, shift your focus. This means limiting the time spent thinking about things that bother you and intentionally turning your attention towards a kind act, helping someone, expressing gratitude to others, or feeling awe for the world around you. Number three, stay connected. Connect with others in person or virtually. We can stay socially close even if we are physically distant. Number four, get outside to help boost your mood. I mean it, even in the winter. Number five, engage in self-care. Pay attention to what feels good to you. Eat healthy foods, prioritize good sleep, stay hydrated, and maintain a daily routine. The most important thing is that you find things that make you feel good. Number six, get your vitamin D3. In northern climates like Wisconsin, the sun's rays are not strong enough to give us what we need. Talk with your doctor about supplements, the daily recommendation in the U.S. is 1,000 international units. Mushrooms and fish are also a natural source of vitamin D. Number seven, light therapy. Consider using a light therapy box, which has also been shown to be effective for certain individuals with seasonal affective disorder. Number eight, call a professional. Speak with a provider if you experience feelings of being down or have decreased interest in doing the things that used to bring you joy. Especially if these symptoms are disruptive to your daily life, you feel hopeless, or you're having thoughts of suicide. Thanks for watching, Badgers, and as always, we are here for you.